I need some light. Is there... Oh. Okay. Hey, the amazing Rando. Watch Rando the Great construct sets with his very mind. <laughs> What's up, rascals? Welcome back to Layers of Fear, and uh, we're continuing on with our exploration of the house, which is getting angrier and more degraded as we go, so, uh, yay? Cretans, blind fools, ignorance. Well, somebody's having a complex. Ooh, that's kind of creepy. That's a. It looks like Don Corleone, if I'm honest. But still, kind of a creepy looking grin there. Don't lock me in, please. Thank you. In fact, you can close the door if you want. I'm done in that room, I think. Am I done in that room? Is there anything I need to look at and pick up? Or is there something that I didn't notice. Do I look out the window? No? Okay. Just had to make sure, because you never know. I'm going to go ahead and be nice and what's in here? Another strange wardrobe. Placement of this stuff is kind of weird, and I'm wondering if maybe that has something to do with how mentally twisted this guy is. Maybe all this is in my head and oh, this is new. Okie dokie. I'm gonna... Should I... I can't go in here so I have no choice but to go downstairs and and uh, see what's in the study or whatever this place is. What, anything, anything worth looking at in here? Anything worth uh, looking at on the desk? What about this picture? Can I not pick this picture up? It looks like it could be important. Like a thing to pick up. Or maybe not. I'll just turn on these lights. Can I climb the ladder? No. Probably not with my leg. But we can check this out. Just pass on through and, uh... Okay. Ring, ring, telephone. What? Where? Where? Apparently it's on the right side of... Okie dokie! That was different. But where can I. Is it going to. There you are! Hi! Um. Hello? I guess I gotta go another round and, uh then see what it does from there. If I can pick it up and answer the phone. Hello? No? All right, what if I go the other way? That seems to be a thing that uh, these kind of things like to do. Oh, now it's moving forward, so I guess I was going the wrong way. Interesting. Okie dokie. See what happens now. Whoa. Now we're back downstairs. Yes, speak. Hello? Yes, speak. Yes, speak. What? 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 What fire? fire. Oh, God. God. Is she. she. Which hospital? Which hospital? I'm on my way. 
So the wifey poo was in a fiery accident. Was the baby okay? I'm pretty sure that uh, the wife wasn't so much because the evidence that we found earlier from him yelling about skin grafts, I guess not so much, but uh, okay, go on through here. Restless memories. Yeah, it's not the only thing that's restless, given how much shit's been thrown at me by this house. Um. Ooh! What the hell was that? Hello? Whoa. Huh. Oh. All right. What does that say? I need some light. Is there. Oh. Okay. That works, I suppose. I missed out on something because of that, but whatever. Flapping horror, be quiet. Constantly flapping, eating other rats. A rat bat? Who see? What? That's kind of an interesting creature combination. It's animal magic. Animal tragic. Speaking of tragic, this story is kind of leaning towards that in a certain way. But, not really surprising. It is a horror game after all, what do you expect? Now, what's going on in here? More hallway. With deer! Deer heads? Hello? What's going on over there? What are you- Whoa! Whoa! What's going on? Hello? The silhouette? Can I- Whoa! Something just forced me down. I wasn't cool. I'm not at all thrilled about that, but uh, pressing on we shall be doing. So why not? Hope is in the m hope is the mind killer. What? What does that even mean? Going through the elevator again. I'm not a fan of that, but progress and all that such. Come on. Let me close. Let me close the door. Why do you gotta always fight me on this? Thank you. Down we go. Oh, okay. All right, what are we gonna see this time? What's that say? Abandon. Abandon hope while you can. Okie dokie. Well, that ain't no Dante's Inferno, but still. In any case, as your lawyer, I advise you to refrain from any imprudent actions. In other words, don't do anything stupid. We still have a chance of winning this. Believe it or not, I've gotten clients out of deeper shit than this. Just don't make it any worse. Lay low for a while and let me appeal to the court order. This social worker definitely has it in for you. We can use that to our advantage. Portray you as a victim of the system. A husband in mourning. A momentary lapse of reason. An overzealous bureaucrat. Trust me, this is our best option. Considering what you've been through lately, I'd say we have a good 50-50 chance of good outcome. But not if you keep trying to convince everyone that you've gone completely insane. No more outbursts. No more rambling. Better yet, no public appearances whatsoever. You can still have your dog. That's, an, that's a weird way to finish that. Considering there's obviously enough there to add the last three letters. But it provides enough context clue to let us know that after what happened to the wife, we kind of started to lose it and uh, 
Social services is on our butts trying to take away our child, and we're not having none of that. But, uh, things as they are. Do I want to... Hello, rat! What's in here? What kind of madness are we about to see? It's a... It's a sink. Okay. Just let it run. Why not? Alright. What about through here? That's all barricaded. I can't get through it, so maybe I can. Ha ha! Genius. What about this door, though? It's just a bathroom that just blinked lights out. Um, a little apprehensive about going in here. That's probably going to change the course of the story. There's no way to really save and change progress later. Fuck it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh. Hello, the baby doll. Silent floaters. They clog the drains. Fur in the water. No baths for me. Yummy. Whoa. Uh, yeah, I kind of... I'm a little bit not thrilled about that. That's a little gross. All right, all right, moving on. I guess we can go this way no matter what. What's through here? Turn on a light. Can we turn on a light? This door's locked. All right, fine. We'll come back to it maybe, probably. I don't know. I doubt it. Even if we do come back to it, another way there's probably not going to be it's probably not going to be the same way it would have been this time round did we just go in a big old loop again probably maybe I don't know but the house is leading us to some kind of something all right, what about... That's all brick wall. That's all brick wall. So, I literally inadvertently chose the only correct path. Fine by me. And things get all distorted and wobbly weird. And, uh... Oh, it reminds me of Zelda. Ocarina of Time and such. The whole twisted corridor thing, you know? Like the, uh, the forest temple? Hello. Alright, cool. We've got light. I like light. Light helps things not be so scary, even though it's probably not gonna matter much, because something's gonna jump in my face. I bet. I'm pretty sure. I'm almost positive. Or I'm going to fall through the floor. One of those two things. Okay. Here's something's going to happen. You hear that, right? Ooh, what's happening here? What was that? What did I miss? I missed something. I missed something big. I bet. I think. I'm not sure. Either way, what's the piano doing down here? Whoa. More of that happening. Do it again? Yep. More shenanigans. Ultra shenanigans. Gravity has decided to, uh, take a break for the day. Cool. Um. What do I... Where do I go now? Just mosey on through while this is happening? Because this is wild. 
And there it goes. It's it's the magic is done. Partially. I'm almost Okay, I see what's happening. Anytime a sour note hits, the the spell is temporarily broken. Should I even Should I even go upstairs? Probably. Whoa. Wait. Now what's happened? Everything's gone. There's nothing left but that note there. I think it's a note. It's something to investigate. I needed to remove the flesh from the bone. At first, I was lost as to how. But then I sawed it off with a handsaw. Boiled it. Then put the bone in a mortar. I had to get one, obviously. This was not something I'd done before. Finally, I mixed the dust with some white paint. It made for a lovely undercoat. Oh, joy! Uh, okay. All right, so, yeah. Where the hell was he getting these body parts and blood and such? He didn't do this to his wife, did he? Oh, here we go again. More shenanigans. Yeah, those are locked right now, but once I do this, I'm pretty sure. What now? What kind of strange form is taking shape here? Okay, that's kind of looking like a corpse splayed out on a pike or something. And, uh, yay. There's another one of his trophies of nastiness and evil all right so obviously we're going to continue this but we're going to end this episode right here hope you guys are enjoying this series with me if you are let me know by giving that like button a bop leave some comments down below and i will see you in the next video hopefully it'll amaze